Hey, this is Lewis from SoFly, and in this video I'll show you how to style plugin output from inside of Oxygen. To style plugin output, selector detector must be enabled. So to enable that, from your WordPress and Bin panel, go to Oxygen Settings, and make sure the Enable Selector Detector box is checked, and then save the changes. Once selector detector is enabled, from inside Oxygen, simply click your plugin output, whether that is coming from an inner content, a widget, or a short code. Uh, then the Style Output button will appear on the bottom left. Click that to enter selector detector mode. And now you can simply click your plugin output to style it. So let's create styles for the Submit button. So I've clicked the Submit button. It's detected input, which is all form inputs. We don't want that. We want it to be the Submit button. So mousing over input, I have some other options like WP Contact Form 7 dash submit, and now we're only going to style the submit button. And let's say we only want to style it for this particular form, so this form short code. Okay, now we've detected a CSS selector. Let's apply some styles to it. So I'll go background color of blue and size and spacing. Let's try a width of 100%. And let's go with a padding of 20 pixels on all sides. Let's remove the border, border none. Let's go typography, font family, display, open sans. Let's go color white, font size 21 pixels. Um, font weight is going to be 600. Font smoothing anti-aliased. Cool. OK, now we've created a selector for our submit button. To find that again, we can go to Manage Selectors, Uncategorized, Uncategorized Custom Selectors, and here is our selector. So I'm going to give this a friendly name. I'm going to call it Contact Form Submit Button, and I'm going to put it in a folder. I'll add a style set called, sorry, not a folder, a style set. So I'll add a style set called Contact Form. And now we have a Contact Form style set over here, and inside is my Contact Form Submit Button style. So I can easily come back and tweak that later. OK, next up, let's style the form inputs themselves. So click the form. Let's close the structure panel so we can see everything at full size. Click Style Output. Click on Input. So now we're styling the form inputs. Let's make sure these are only inputs in this contact form, in this short code. And we'll call this, we'll put it in contact form. We'll call it uh, text field. Now I'll go to advanced and borders. Let's add a one pixel solid gray border. And let's go to typography, font size 21, uh, line height of 1.2. Uh, let's go to, um, what else do we want to do to this? I'd say add a little padding on it. So let's say six pixels padding top and bottom. Unfortunately, we can see that that's actually overriding the styles for the button. So that means we need to use a less specific selector here. So to edit that selector, we can just go right there and edit it. And now it's a less specific selector, so it won't override the button styles. OK, those are our inputs. Let's edit those again to apply those styles to the text area. So we'll click the input, and we'll just copy the selector paste and replace input with text area. So as you can see, you have to know CSS to be able to do this. So if you don't know CSS, this isn't really going to help you. But if you do, it's just a easier way, a point and click way to style plugin output inside Oxygen. So here is our completed styled contact form. Okay, that is how to style plugin output with Oxygen. Thank you very much for watching.